So this is about vegetable juice. Um, so I get organic lemons and I put about one quarter of a lemon per, per quart of fluid. So this is half full. I've been doing celery. Mostly I do celery, but it's summer. I've got some kale growing out front, so I put in about eight kale leaves into one batch and I had a zucchini that I chopped up and I've put zucchini a um, couple handfuls in each quart um, worth of zucchini um, cubes and then uh, a little bit of parsley in the first one so the first one I did had zucchini, celery, lemon, kale and parsley and then all the other ones have celery and zucchini and some lemon and then the last few will just have celery um, I'm using a ninja juicer. It's a masticating juicer. So there's a, a threaded piece in here. It turns, it creates the juice, it comes out, there's a strainer in here. It gets clogged up when I juice the pulp. So I'll like clear it out to help the yield. Um, if you're just juicing the regular stuff, it doesn't clog up. So that's kind of nice. But what I do is I save my pulp. Some pulp here. You can see the kale and the parsley and the zucchini um, and the lemon. So I juice the pulp again and it's a pretty decent yield. I'd recommend juicing your pulp once or twice. If you have a green star, you don't have to do any of this. Um, so far, I've got about this will be six stalks of celery and it will get me about a gallon of juice and um, the pulp will get me another probably half gallon, two quarts. So juice is a good thing to do. Um, it's important. Oh yeah, and you can strain your juice with a cheesecloth. Strain out some of that extra fiber. It kind of gets annoying because it gets clogged up. You got to push it through or squeeze it. Um, but it's worth it. it. It gets out a lot of fiber. And yeah, the lemon actually will help it separate faster. But I just drink the fiber anyway. It's so small. It's like dust. And um, yeah, it makes a big difference, especially if you feel over acidic, like you're, you're um, kind of on edge, you don't have an appetite. Meat and fat will kind of make you gag. Probably means you, means you need some more vegetable juice. One thing I found too is that if you make a hydration formula with like cucumber and tomato, it's um, pretty alkalizing, so you know that can kind of make up for your veg juice um, a little bit if you're not too acidic. If you're too acidic, you might need veg juice and to do that. But uh, I just kind of noticed that. Um, but yeah, this is, that's how you veg juice. Um, I use well water to wash, so my uh, cleaning formula is like. A good bit of whey, like half a cup of whey, half of a lime, some juice, and then a couple of teaspoons of apple cider vinegar in a bowl. I let it sit for 10 minutes. And um, if I was using tap water, I would just add in some milk into all that. Um, but there you go. That's what you need to know about vegetable juice. Have any questions? Leave them in the comment section.